Well, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Trading Wars. Thanks for joining me today. I'm going to be showing you a quick guide on the opening range breakout. So if you're ready, my friends, let's step into the war zone. First and foremost, the opening range breakout, I only like to use it in volatile situations. So what are volatile situations? Well, if we let the first three minute bar play today, you could see that we opened above the previous day's high and we had a huge, huge bearish candle. So those are the situations where I like to use the orb, not when we're opening inside of the range with tiny candles. Also, we had uh, CPI news in the pre-market. So again, that's giving me another reason to want to trade the orb because I'm looking for volatility. So what we do here with the opening range breakout, guys, all we do is is we mark the low like this and we mark the high. And all I'm doing is I'm letting the market tell me what to do. So if it breaks the low, I'm going to short. If it breaks the high, I'm going to go long. So you can see the next candle comes in. We break the low and boom, 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 we flush straight down. So it's a really quick and easy trade. The 394 puts went from $1.30 to $2.65, 103%. And futures, which I primarily trade, went for 25 points, $1,250 per contract. Really, really good. Um, and again, let me go ahead and just show you in the Discord right here so I could show you guys this was not hindsight. So that was at 625 Pacific, 925 Eastern, focusing on the orb short orb so we got short at 933 send the red target one hit i scaled out on the first five points put my stop loss to break even then i got eight and just kept scaling um after as we went lower and lower so best orb of the year by far for us this book right here the spy options mastery book talks about the orb we have over 50 charts and 69 pages worth of great information don't forget to subscribe to the youtube channel take care